As the gentleman from Pennsylvania has a minute and one quarter, and the gentleman from Massachusetts has a minute and a half. Um, Pennsylvania is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And I have no further speakers at this time. I yield myself the balance of the one minute I have left. The gentleman is recognized for a minute and a quarter. A minute, excuse me, a minute and a quarter, and I'll use the full minute and a quarter. How about that? Uh, Mr. Speaker, I'm an Iraq War veteran. I was in Baghdad uh, for six months in 2009. I can tell you that I'm committed to ensuring the men and women who served our nation receive the care and benefits they deserve. It's of utmost importance to me uh, as a member of this body and as, a, as an Iraq War veteran. And that's the reason why I'm so disappointed in my friends across the aisle. I'm disappointed that instead of considering the Senate passed Health Care for Burn Pit Veterans Act, which again could immediately be sent to the president's desk, House Democrats are prioritizing legislation that's still a long way away from enactment and that will delay benefits for toxic exposed veterans. Let me be clear, we could get help to veterans. We could get this bill to the desk of the president by the end of this week. The only thing standing in the way are my friends on the other side of the aisle. It's for that reason I urge my colleagues to vote no on the previous question and vote no on the rule. And with, the, with that, I yield back my time. The gentleman yields back.